like this. Like, you do it like this. Okay, like no, Tom, no, like this. Tom, Tom. Hey. <laughs> Over 30 and years ago, we originally did Say by the Bell. Yeah. And uh, I can't believe we're back. Like, we're standing about? in the max right now. Right. Which is the most surreal thing. Like, when we wrapped, tears were shed. We thought that was it. This affirms that you never know in life. Ever wish you could go back? Sure do. Wish granted. We're returning to our Bayside roots, but three decades later, our roles have obviously evolved a bit. In attendance will be the governor of California. To bring you up to speed, Zach Morris is running the state and still happily married to Kelly Kapowski. Meanwhile, Old Flames' Jesse Spano and A.C. Slater find themselves working together at Bayside High. She is the school counselor, and I am the athletic director. Yo, Mama. Sorry, Dr. Mama. Hey, Mama. But not to worry, not too much has changed. Even the show's original set was replicated flawlessly. Look at these lockers, still pristine, bright red. You're going to see a lot of nods from the original episodes back in the day, a lot of to the early 90s. <laughs> you might see Slater bust out some moves. You might, you might see him bust out a couple little moves from back in the day. He might have to get a little athletic on you, too, because he's kind of stuck in that era. Well, at least the hair has gotten an upgrade. First of all, the mullet was unintentional. I just like to rock my hair longer because back in that era, Mel Gibson, like in Lethal Weapon, Steven Seagal, that whole action hero, all those guys had long hair like that. So, uh, you know, being a kid, I think I, I just try to emulate him. 